Hello. Uh, just a quick question. Do any of you, uh, do either of you, uh, have you heard of the, the new Netflix show that's coming about the Transformers and are you voicing anyone? Like I said, I can't speak to anything that I don't know about. So I, I'm aware of it, but I don't know anything more than that. that it's I'll be stupid. honest, I just heard about it today <laughs> when you guys mentioned it. Also, can either of you do the shockwave line? It depends on what shockwave you're wanting, because he does Transformers front shockwave. Why don't you do your shockwave, and I'll do my shockwave. We'll see how Destroy the launch pad. Let none escape. Thank you. But, uh, and, my, and my version, what, I don't mind doing that. We don't, we don't mind. It's okay. Go for it. What's your name? Uh, uh, Dennis. Dennis, you are logical. <laughs> Thank you. See, it's, it's a very different interpretation, but they're both valid, right? Yeah. It's just... Well, I, I got a little bit of flack from some fans on some website about him not being calm, and, and but I was like, well, he's he's still giving out orders to a big group of guys, and sound still care like how sound carries in space. Let's just avoid that whole thing. Uh, so I was like, well, he's still calm, cold, and calculating. He's just giving out orders into a, you know, people that are not right next to him. So. And when I first started a shockwave, I got a few fans saying, why don't you sound like Corey Burton? So you just, you know, people get used yeah, to it. Yeah, you never know. I was like, because Travis, Travis Knight told me to do it that way, so. <laughs> <laughs> we're, it's like in a way we're invited into someone's house as a guest. Yeah. And we have to wipe our feet. Mm-hmm. Take your shoes off. Let's sit on the <laughs> plastic covered couches, don't you know. Don't spill anything on the couch, yeah.